My name is Nina Fuller. I'm an attorney and I practice medical negligence law with my firm, Fuller & Fuller. Many of the clients that I represent in medical negligence cases are children who have been injured in the labor and delivery process. Of course, these children are often disabled and will need lifelong care. Parents are understandably very concerned. Who will take care of my disabled child? There are many government benefits available to assist disabled children. But, of course, there's a concern. If I bring a medical negligence claim, will it affect the benefits that my child is currently receiving? The most common benefit that disabled children receive is Social Security, which is also called SSI. There are certain critical steps that have to be taken when a medical malpractice claim is brought in order to avoid stopping those SSI benefits. The best way of doing this is often through the creation of a special needs trust. A special needs trust can take the money that your, that your child receives by way of a medical malpractice settlement and can use it to pay for special needs that your child has without affecting the Social Security supplemental income payments. For example, a special needs trust might cover a van that your child needs for transportation, might cover extra costs that are incurred in traveling with your child, for example. Our primary goal here at Fuller & Fuller when we're representing disabled children is to ensure that each child has the ability and the resources to reach his or her maximum potential. By creation of a special needs trust, we can help your child reach that maximum potential. Thank you.